talking strokes today in our Focus on Health segment and Docs on Call. And also a special seminar coming up through Norton Healthcare. We have Dr. Shervin Dashti here with us today from Norton Neuroscience Institute. Tell us about your specialty first. Uh, I'm an endovascular neurosurgeon. Um, I specialize in treating vascular disorders of the brain and spinal cord. Um, we treat things like uh, aneurysms, AVMs, uh, acute stroke, mm -hmm. uh, carotid disease, intracranial stenosis, uh, the whole gamut of vascular disorders in the brain and the spinal cord. And you say strokes and hang aneurysms kind of go hand in hand. Well, uh, stroke, uh, I guess we, we can start with the definition of mm -hmm. a stroke. The stroke is uh, uh, when a localized area of the brain dies because of lack of blood flow, because of uh, interruption in the supply of blood to that part of the brain. Um, that can cause uh, significant uh, morbidity and mortality. Uh, aneurysm uh, is, is a little bit of a different thing, but it, it causes what we call, a, we call a hemorrhagic stroke. Aneurysm is a blister off of a blood mm -hmm. vessel that can hemorrhage and uh, cause bleeding over the surface of the brain and also cause significant problems, disability and death. So um, they're kind of two different uh, ends of the same spectrum. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, both uh, diseases are, are uh, what I treat uh, in Absolutely. my practice. Absolutely, yeah, yeah, and you save lives of people suffering both. We have a caller yeah. with a question for you, Dr. Dashti. Sure. This is Deborah from Sellersburg. Go ahead, Deborah, with your question. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, good afternoon. And I would like to find out, uh, I have... Uh, my face on the left side uh, droops down. It has like two or three different times. And uh, also, my left arm has been numb since uh, I had blood clots in my left arm. And uh, anyway, they've resolved since because I had a Doppler. But uh, the hand is numb. But this facial thing's bothered me. And then also, when I looked at my clock, which has got red uh, numbers, it's kind of a hot pink at times. And I don't know if that, you know, I would really like to have your advice on what you think, you know, I should do about that. Well, uh, the, the, you know, the symptoms you described, the facial drooping, for example, uh, the numbness in the arm, um, uh, visual disturbances, those are all possible symptoms, uh, signs of stroke. I definitely think you should be seen by your primary care doctor and uh, get a workup. Uh, it, it doesn't mean you're necessarily having a stroke. Uh, for example, facial drooping could be Bell's palsy, which is a self-limiting uh, 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 event. However, you don't want to assume that's what it is. More often than not, people are having uh, stroke-like symptoms, transient ischemic attacks causing facial, facial weakness. So I think that's something definitely you need to bring, uh, seek medical attention. And mm -hmm. seeking medical attention uh, uh, sooner than later is, 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 a lot, is very important uh, because so uh, call your doctor today, Deborah, right? Exactly, okay. yeah, or, or yesterday. Yeah. Thank, thank you, Deborah. And any other stroke signs that we should be aware yeah, of? The signs of stroke, she actually hit on a, on mm -hmm. a few of them. Um, weakness, uh, especially on one side of the body, arm or leg or face, which is what she was describing. Uh, uh, numbness, also, mm -hmm. especially on one side of the body. Uh, as, all these things happen usually suddenly. Loss of coordination and balance, um, confusion, uh, inability to speak, mm -hmm. any of those things happening suddenly, or it's a very severe headache that's unexplainable, which would be a sign of uh, aneurysm hemorrhage. And, and to talk much more about knowing the signs, we have a special seminar, if we can put that information on the screen. It is Thursday, May 12th, from 6 to 8 at the Norton Brownsboro Hospital Cafeteria, and there's the number to call, 629-1234, to register. Dr. Dashi, thanks so much for being with us Thank and you. bringing such incredible information for, that we should all be aware of. We appreciate that. Great. We're back with much more in just a moment.